it's Vicki Marie. Today we're going to run into Family Dollar Store. I had not been in there in a while and I just ran in to actually to get some tuna fish and check out what's on the food aisles, you know, the food shelves. Uh, I've been very mindful of saving money in that area, you know, so uh, I'm trying to shop on a budget, but I also did check out their spring decor and their makeup area too. They had some really cute things for Mother's Day uh, that's coming up. Uh, so, you know, I love candles and things like that. And, um, yeah, so let's jump into that uh, really quick. And then, um, yeah, let's do that right here. So I came over to the Family Dollar Store. I have not been here in a while, and it's right down the street. So I decided to come in here rather than going to one of the bigger stores uh, since I only needed uh, the tuna fish. So um, pricing out makeup, pricing out home decor, um, I just feel like the Family Dollar Store uh, has a lot to offer because they have a nice selection. Maybe the quality is not the greatest on some things, but um, really for just fill in and just uh, just you know seasonal home decor that you're you know you're really just using anyway for the season. And we change it up so often. I just think you really, you really can't can't beat it. The paper products less in there for a dollar, but better than the dollar store, like the Dollar Tree. Great value. I'm going to talk to you guys in a minute about these. Those were five dollars, really, for the home uh, porch lane signs. Seven bucks for this. Not a good quality. Fine for a little kid. Love these. And you know, they're a dollar. The solar stakes, a dollar here. And at Dollar Tree, I mean, they're a dollar twenty-five. I, I'm pretty sure they they went up. Fifteen. That was a good deal. Three dollars for these, but they're bigger and they're good quality. And these little floral solar lights, I really thought those were super cute. I may go back and buy a couple. Their clearance rack really had some good, uh, useful items. I saw some Cascade and just, just you know, home essentials there, toothpaste and their home decor here, just, just a really good selection. This was $5 and, you know, not bad. Uh, not the best quality, but again, for the price, uh, you could work with it. And I thought this was actually pretty good. These candles smell really good, by the way. I did uh, sample some of them, and they actually smell really nice. These smell really good too, very clean scent. And I was just looking, they had my deodorant and they had good vitamins, a good selection. They didn't have as much as far as tuna fish. I was able to get some though. They really do have a good selection of essentials. If you're just trying to figure out what's for dinner, you just need to pick up a few things. Uh, I'm not going to overlook this store I anymore. I, I tend to forget it's here, but it's good so prices. So here's what I bought today. So you can see, I don't know if you guys can see that very well. Uh, $16.32. $16 and let me show you what I got for $16.32. So I spent uh, $4.85 on these crunchy breaded fish fillets. I really like these. I haven't had them in a while and I know this is probably not uh, oh the healthiest thing but uh, I thought well I'm gonna go ahead and get some. There's six in there that will be one meal for John and me and what did I what price did I say? Yeah four dollars and eighty five cents and that's got six fillets in there. These were also four dollars and eighty five cents. I did double check that. Um, the pedigree dinner stick. Uh, Roscoe loves the pe these uh, dinner sticks, but I've never bought this particular uh, flavor. It's the bacon flavor. He gets one of these every night when he before he goes to bed. He gets a, a dinner stick, and he also gets one when he wakes up. So, and sometimes he'll just get get a half when he wakes up. But yeah, I give it to him basically twice a day, and he hasn't tried this flavor so. That dog looks happy, and that doggy looks a little like Roscoe, so maybe Roscoe will like it too. Now, if he doesn't like it, I'll just give it to my uh, my nephew dog. I also, for three dollars and forty-five cents, bought 
a can of this uh, Swanson chicken. I just wanted it in my pantry, the premium chunk uh, chicken breast. Uh, this can be in a pinch, you know, you could make like an like if I didn't have my chicken that I cook in the instant pot, my chicken breast, I could throw this into with my Alfredo sauce and make a nice chicken Alfredo. Um, and serve that with pasta. I can also, like I've done before and showed you guys, serve it over bread, like whole wheat bread. I mean, that's actually a really decent little meal. Um, I just like to have it in my pantry. So I went and picked that up. Now I did get this $1.40 a can. These are four ounce cans. It does say wild caught and it's a chunk light. It is in vegetable oil, which usually I do buy it in water, not the oil. So that's going to be a little different than what we're used to. And frankly, I will probably kind of, I don't know, just make sure I drain it really, really well. Um, I don't think I'll rinse it. I might. And then mix it with my other ingredients for my uh, tuna salad. So that's, that is what I am buying today. That's my haul, y'all. So that was my little shop with me at the Family Dollar. Um, and, you know, just a, a couple of notes. Now, the when I walked in, you saw the the, the Maybelline mascara. Uh, it was like five dollars and I think sixty something cents, and I didn't buy it because I always got it for four dollars and forty four cents at Walmart. But when I went over and checked Walmart's prices, they've gone up to, and I probably should have just grabbed it at the Family Dollar. So um, it was it was comparable to the Family Dollar and or to Walmart. So I, that would have been a good buy. And then they had just really cute home decor. That home, uh, the home porch lean sign was very very flimsy. Uh, so it's I, if I would have put that on my porch, it would have blown away. But it was five dollars. And I thought for five bucks, I could have anchored that down and saved some money rather than going over to where I've seen some of those porch leaning signs at Walmart and at the uh, trailer, the tractor, tractor supply company. Walmart and, and the trailer, the tractor store had those home decor porch lean signs for $24.99. Granted, they were way better quality, heavier, and if you want something that you know, you're going to be able to use year after year, I would go for that. But if you're just looking for just a whimsical piece to add to your porch this season, um, I think the $5 at the home, uh, at Family Dollar, it would, be, would have been perfect. So also on their food aisle, uh, I thought their food was actually pretty decent, uh, that they didn't have a selection like the tuna. I had to get the oil-based when I always usually get the spring water-based, things like that. Um, and I noticed like their, their sweet rolls and little Debbie kind of things, they were very good price compared to what I've seen at other places. So, uh, yep. So if you guys are on a budget and you're, you know, don't, don't overlook the family dollar store for things, especially if it's near your home and you don't have to spend a ton of money on gas to get there, which is why I went there. It's, it's closer to my home. It's like a quarter of the distance, uh, than like Walmart or one of the other grocery stores. So, all right. Well, that's my quick little video today. And I just thought I would do an intro here and, uh, and we'll wrap that up. So, um, I do have another similar, uh, store that I'm going to go to. It's called Save a Lot. That will be on another video. That's coming up. But I'm getting some like allergy stuff you'll notice on my neck. And I commented on, on Barbara Jean, age is just a number. She had talked about how her eyelids were getting this uh, eczema, eczema kind of stuff, dermatitis, whatever. I'm not, I'm not sure exactly what to call it. And I said, you know, I used to get that and I hadn't got it in a while. And now, um, I, and I thought, well, oh, I don't know why I haven't gotten it. And then like, Two days later, bam, I'm, I'm getting it. And I always get it here on my neck and my eyelids. I haven't had got it in years. So interesting. I don't know why I threw that in, but just in case you noticed, uh, this is all red and it's just what it is today. But yeah, I think we're all having to deal with the weather. <laughs> so, but hey, let's uh, keep our chin up and it's always more fun to shop with friends. And I like to take you guys along on my during my day and hopefully we can keep each other lifted up and having a little fun in life and uh yeah because you know what it's over way too soon all right well that's my video today thank you so much for watching and for hanging out with me today if you haven't i hope that you will hit that subscribe button click that notification bell and come on back i will see you on the next one bye